All right, everybody, we're back with Kimber's puppies. These are our medium to small standard size Australian Mountain Doodles. Everybody kind of is favoring this one right now just based off of looks because he has a lot of looks like mom with the black leg and the black ear. A lot of boys in the litter. Um, so some of the collars are gonna not really reflect boy or uh, girl, but we just put them on there just to show. All right, Kimber, you can hop out if you uh, want to. She's kind of holding on the puppies there. Now Kimber's being an excellent mom. She's a beautiful girl. We're proud of her. Come on, Kimber. You can stay on the puppies when I take her out. <laughs> Just go around the room a little bit and I'll have to watch Kimber. Kimber, come on. Jimmy. Hey, play, play with Kimber for a little bit. I'm going to do a video. Alright, I'm coming back. Sorry for the delay. We just put collars on them right now, so I'm just gonna, it's just to help you guys if you're interested in a specific puppy to tell me which one was which. This is a male, there's nine males, one female. This is a red collar, black tri male. Cute little dude. And this is a light blue collar, black tri male. He's got some pretty unique markings. I like the white on his nose. Can you see him okay? Yeah. All right, we did red and blue. This was a black tri male as well, but he has a tan collar on. He's one of the smaller ones. The black puppies, for some reason, they let me hold them and they do well. Some of the merles and reds have been squirmy so far. This is a male, but there's a lavender collar on him. See, they don't really like it yet. They don't like to be held. All right, let's go through the Merles here. We already talked about this boy. And then yellow collar Merle male. I can't determine blue eyes on any of the Merles right now. He's kind of squirmy. And then let's talk about the red tries. Purple collar, red tri boy. Really flashy colors, perfect white stripe up the nose. Lots of white on the belly too, if you see the belly. <laughs> And then the other one has a gray collar on. The other red tri. Can you see the difference between reds and blacks? Is it like the color differences? You know what I'm saying? Yep. You see it on video. Mm -hmm. Gray collar, I'm not happy. The merles and the reds, I don't know why. They're everybody's favorite, but this time they're not liking me holding them. So we're gonna work with them. But all the black puppies seem to be loving it. This is our only female in the litter. She's got the peach collar on. She's a cute black tri. Love her temperament so far and her beautiful markings. Love it. If nobody claims her, I might keep her. We'll see. Um, anyway, doing good. All 10 puppies are, their eyes are open, their ears are open. They're regulating their own body temperature at this age. Nate, move around a little bit so you can see him. Come down here and just kind of aim at the puppies. Can you see pretty, pretty well on your phone? Yes, sir. A nice variety in colors of this litter. All of them have tan points on their face with their eyebrows and cheek line. And uh, we're waiting to see if any of the blue merles have blue eyes. I don't think any of them will have full blue eyes. We might have some flecks in there. So we'll see. But again, Kimber's doing excellent taking care of them. I'm probably going to stick to a lot of video um, communication rather than pictures because they're so squirmy I can't get good photos. The black tri puppies did, so you'll see their pictures today. But the merles and reds haven't given me hardly any good photos. But boy, they're pretty. All right, we're going to hop out of the box and just kind of watch them a little bit. Adorable litter. Nine boys, one girl. Cuties. <laughs> we'll see you next week.